What's up, YouTube? Out here sitting out here uh, at the house on the front porch on a uh, Sunday night, drinking a cold beer, getting ready to fire up a cigar. Smoked uh, one of these guys, was it Friday, Saturday? I don't know. I smoked the Churchill with Connecticut wrapper on it, and I didn't really like it. It's kind of plain. This one, um, already, uh, already cut it off. Um, wrapper smells good. Uh, good taste on the lips. Um, a bit spicy. I don't know, this label's purple on this one. Kind of hard to tell a little bit. Um, man, so this one uh, smells a lot better. It's been sitting beside a uh, Taro 858 Maduro and a couple of hand rolled uh, cigars I got from um, this uh, cigar place I go to. Uh, one of them's a barbershop shop pole, and one of them's a. Oh, I can't remember what, a perfecto maybe, is what you call it. It's um, both of them from Honduras, hand uh, hand rolled. Uh, I'll be doing a video on them because they're pretty cool looking. Um, then had the barbershop pole one time and it was all right, and I haven't had the uh, perfecto yet. You know, and the perfecto is a Maduro, and the uh, the barbershop one's a Maduro with I can't natural wrapper, and it was all right. No, nothing, no big deal, but it was all right. Well, I'm getting ready to fire this thing up. Like I said, it uh, tastes pretty good. The the draw on it was good, um, but a little loose, but I mean, maybe it's because it's uh, kind of moist. But yeah, this, one, this one's big. This is a six by maybe 60. Um, this, is, this is a pretty big cigar. Um, I think I'm probably going to like this one. And again, the other one was in the 250 range that I smoked from this company. And I think this one was maybe in the 270 to 290 dollar range. So, I mean, not bad. I think it, it probably was about $2.70 because the other one was a little bit cheaper. And uh, this one already is starting off better than the other one. So, I'm hoping for better things to come out of this one. Alright guys, thanks. Thanks.